Hi friends, this is Rolando with today's Latin American headlines. And we start in Venezuela, where Iran's oil minister met with President Nicolas Maduro in Venezuela to discuss ways to overcome the effects of sanctions imposed by the United States on both nations. Maduro called it, quote, a productive meeting to deepen the ties of brotherhood and cooperation in energy matters. And now we move to Paraguay, where Oscar Dennis, who served as vice president of that country from 2012 to 2013, spent his 600th day of captivity this week. Dennis was abducted from his ranch by members of the Paraguayan People's Army, or EPP, a Marxist rebel group. And now as a follow-up to yesterday's post, Colombia's interior minister, Daniel Palacio, announced that the government will provide left-wing presidential candidate Gustavo Petro with extra security after he had to cancel part of his campaign tour due to reports of a threat to assassinate him. And in another follow-up, the leader of Haiti's Mawazo gang, which last year abducted a group of missionaries from the United States and is believed to be behind the kidnapping of a Dominican diplomat, was extradited to the United States yesterday, according to Haitian police. Germain Jolie, known as Yonion, was taken on an FBI plane to Washington yesterday. This has been Rolando with today's Latin American headlines. Thank you for joining. Now follow, like, comment to add to the conversation.